Hello and welcome to our Treble D Studio House series. In these tutorials we'll be showing you how to quickly create a professional 3D SketchUp model for a modern house. In this video we'll be creating some custom made outdoor living areas at the back of the house. So we have some small wing walls here leading out from the living area and the decks are going to flow out from there. We'll use the wing wall as a template to create a supporting column. So we trace a rectangle and pull it out 900 or 3 feet, then we make it a group. Assign it to the layer decks and call it post. Now we move it into place and make a copy for the other side of the deck and line it up with the wing wall. Now we just push pull it into shape. I'll lift it up 950 or 3 foot 2 to form a handrail. Then pull it up a further 50mm or 2 inches to make a capping piece. Now we just push pull it into shape to match the building. The veranda is intended to provide shelter to the door while also allowing light into the highlight windows above. We'll create a wing wall here to act as a privacy screen for the balcony. And we just add in a bit of detail, make a 50mm or 2 inch wide shadow line and push it in 20mm or 3 quarters of an inch. Now it's looking a bit bulky so I'm just going to cut it back to 1500 wide or 5 feet out from the wing wall. Now we adjust it with the push pull tool. And it's looking good. So we just do a similar thing for the studio. Now copy it over to the dining area. Flip it over and adjust it to suit. And move it into place. So now it's time to create a handrail. There's more detail on this topic in our Beach House series. We get the handrail from the missing out area. Place it on the balcony and move it into place. Now we make a path of travel for the follow me tool. And copy it. Now open up the handrail, paste in the path and use the follow me tool to extrude the rail. Now we repeat the process for the balustrading and Delete the path lines. Now we place these uprights. We'll just have a 450 offset in from the corner, which is 18 inches. Now I'll copy the post up to the other end of the balcony and hit divide by two to create a post at the midpoint. Now we just need to tidy up our decks a bit to coincide with the wing walls. Just push pull it into shape. We make sure that the walls and the decks don't overlap. And that's it. It's all done.
If it's all too hard or if you just don't have the time, please feel free to contact us at Treble D. We have very modestly priced consultants who can help you out with construction drawings or any aspect of the design process. Cheers.